Okay, we got day three here to round out week one. Uh, this is our conditioning day, okay? So it looks a little more like what you would consider a Metcon, although you'll see my very first note is this is not classic CrossFit. We're not trying to go all out and go hard, do this for time or for reps or anything like that. We're still looking to move well. Um, but this is going to look more like what you would see as a Metcon. It's going to be a lot more focused on the upper body and the components of the muscle up, but a very important part of getting muscle ups, and especially for those of you who have muscle ups and you want to get better at getting more, is conditioning your muscles to be able to do a lot of reps, uh, the other things that you need for the muscle up, pull ups, dips, things like that. Um, so that's what we're going to work on here, okay? I really like this workout. It's super fun, 24 minutes. We're going to start out with a 10 minute AMRAP. You're going to go 60 foot suitcase carry. First on the right arm, then on the left arm, or you could go left and then right, it doesn't really matter. But 60 feet on each arm of suitcase carry. Eight to 12 ring dips, okay? You need to hit at least eight every time, no more than 12. Um, and you need to do the same amount every single time. So this doesn't mean just like you can do anywhere between eight and 12. It means that I understand that some of us are at different skill levels than others. So if, if you want to do closer to eight every time, or if you want to do more close to 12 every time, that's fine. Um, but pick a number, uh, for example, say I'm going to do 11 every time. You're going to do that every round, okay? So this is not an excuse to, as you get tired, do less reps. It's just uh, options for you, all right? If you can't do eight ring dips, get a band to where you can do eight ring dips, or maybe even, you know, 10, 12, something like that, um, every single time, okay? Get a band out, no problem. Um, if you don't feel comfortable with the ring dip, getting that full range of motion all the way, biceps all the way down to the rings, right? Low ring dip and pressing all the way out to lock out. That's the most important part um, of the ring dip. Not, not how many reps you get, not how fast, not how good you look doing it. Just getting that full range of motion, biceps to the rings and all the way back up. If you can't do that, even with a band, just because your shoulders bother you, do it on the bar, uh, the matador uh, dip attachment or on the box. It's like we went over with day two skill work, all right? Then you're gonna hop on the rower for 45 seconds. Tough pace, we're not, again, this is not a classic CrossFit workout. We're not trying to go super, super hard, but get on that rower, 45 seconds at a good steady pace, nice, big, long poles, lean back into it, um, and that's where you're gonna kind of build that sweat, and it's gonna keep your arms a little bit fatigued going into each successive round, okay? So suitcase carry, 60 feet on each arm, eight to 12 ring dips, and then 45 seconds on the rower. We're gonna rest for three minutes, and after we do that 10 minute AMRAP, then we're gonna go 10 more minutes, 60 foot suitcase carry on each side, 12 to 15 hand release push-ups. So we're kind of progressively getting a little bit easier. Ring dips, right, are a little bit harder than hand release push-ups, but we're going up in reps. You're gonna be fatigued from the ring dip still. These hand release push-ups are gonna be hard. It's, this is a really good workout, I like this one, okay? 12 to 15 hand release push-ups. Same thing with the ring dips. Choose a number, do it every time. Uh, and if you can't do 12, go to your knees. Um, or find some sort of option, maybe going to a box or something like that where you can get to 12 every time or maybe even a little bit more and stick with that every single time. We're not gonna break these up and you can see, that's a note right here, unbroken sets, unbroken ring dips, unbroken hand release push-ups, the whole workout, okay? Um, and again, choose a band or a resistance or some sort of deficit, you know, you can go up to a box or go to your knees for the hand release push-ups where you can go unbroken the whole workout. Uh, and then 45 seconds on the bike after that, okay? So we went from row to bike, no big deal, easy enough. Um, so 60, 60, 12 to 15 hand release push-ups, unbroken, 45 second bike. Making the videos for the muscle up program.